You can't run away without leaving a note. Oh, what'll I say? Dear mother and father, I hate you. Love, Wednesday. <laughs> Children, we're starting. Put down that antenna. 424, 425, 426. Don't be a baby. I know what I'm doing. to warm up. Why? So it can kill you. I knew that. Why do you hate the baby? We don't hate him. We just want to play with him. Especially his head. For the next two weeks, you are forbidden, absolutely forbidden, to play with your pet spider. <laughs> Not play with Homer. <laughs> Poor Debbie. She was sick. She wasn't sick. She was sloppy. What do you mean? If I wanted to kill my husband, I'd do it. And I wouldn't get caught. How? I'd scare him to death. Nice knife. Can I play autopsy with it? <laughs> the neighbors complained about Aristotle getting loose. What an odd name for a dog. Not for an octopus. That's not true. It is so. Everyone knows it. When you have a new baby, one of the other children has to die. Which one? Well. They only need one boy. I know a place you can run away to for nothing. Where? My room. You can hide there and just pretend you've run away from home. Then I can run away and still be around to see them suffer. <laughs> Let's go. Pugsley, the baby weighs 10 pounds. The cannonball weighs 20 pounds. Which will hit the stone walkway first? I'm still on fractions. Which do you think? The cannonball? Very good. But which one will bounce? The baby? There's only one way to find out. May I have the salt? What do we say? Now. Why are you dressed like that? Like what? Like you're going to a funeral. Why are you dressed like somebody died? Wait. Now one of you will be the drowning victim, and the other one gets to be our lifesaver. I'll be the victim. All your life. What are you, darling? Where's your costume? This is my costume. I'm a homicidal maniac. They look just like everyone else. Are they dead? Does it matter? Let's discuss how to prevent forest fires. Prevent them? Is that your bathing suit? Is that your overbite? All right, children. I've had it up to here. Now you just answer one simple question. Where is that baby? Which part? I like being miserable. You might find a nice girl to be miserable with. <laughs> Hello, kiddies. I'm Polly the Puppet. What shall we do today? I know. Let's all clean our rooms. Hello, Polly. I'll clean my room in exchange for your immortal soul. Oh, Wednesday's at that very special age when a girl has only one thing on her mind. Boys. Homicide. Pugsley, sit in the chair. Why? So we can play a game. What game? It's called... Is there a god? And the angel told the stork, and the stork flew down from heaven and left a diamond under a leaf in the cabbage patch, and the diamond turned into a baby. Our parents are having a baby, too. They had sex. How was school? Terrible, especially history. Yeah, they never tell us anything interesting, like how many heads they chopped off in the French Revolution. But well, darlings, we're going to change all that. We're going to make history interesting by living it. 
Me and we're going to chop up someone's skirt. And Uncle Fester uses a spray-on preservative. Uh, no, you mean a spray-on deodorant. No, preservative. Oh, to keep young? Just to keep. <laughs> I'll buy a cup if you buy a box of my delicious Girl Scout cookies. Do we have a deal? Are they made from real Girl Scouts? Isn't she pretty? <laughs>